So essentially we're gonna be using Restore, we're gonna use using the, the typical um, the Paradox Pro uh, combination and you wanna make sure you use Restore, I try Balance and uh, and, uh, and the rest of the other skills and they don't work as well as uh, Restore. So yeah, I'll say you stick with that, I played it probably I probably want 10 out of 10 you want to make sure you got kindle the swamp in there just in case you need a fusion card uh, and you want to make so dark essentially this is what the deck consists of uh, it's a dark paladin deck combo so essentially you just want to make sure you got some to fuse it to summon the monster as soon as possible so we just have a few extra cards just to make sure that we have a, a little extra pulling power here. So typical uh, unit attack. Great, keep your vessel. We gotta get rid of that, there's no point for that. So yeah, save it. Save the deck. And we're about to get this shit popping. But I'll show you how this shit works. Let's see, let's check out the cars. So, John McCain, that's kind of what you want to go for essentially. You want to go for this one as well, to, so you can make the other, the, so you can make the rest of the deck work. You want to get that as well. You want to get that, that's cool, I guess. The so, John McCain. Not bad, I mean you get to take two of the spaces instead of three. But what we want to go for is uh, three spaces rather than two. To make sure that your opponent doesn't have anything else to bring to the table. But essentially we just take care of those uh, life points right away. As soon as, uh, as soon as we're able to take care of the field, uh, the game is ours essentially. So this is a pretty good deck, I'll say that this is a kinder game deck, anybody using it will probably make it. Right now we just, uh, let's see, uh, we don't need right now to uh, restart, cause uh, we got what's necessary now to summon the, to summon Dark Paladin, so this, this is essentially one of the best hands that you can start with. Because uh, you just want to make sure the monster is on the field as soon as possible. So let's see. Now you just basically do what you typically do, which is just wait it out until the very end. Uh, here you probably want to, you probably just want to thin out the deck to make sure to, make, to speed out the process because you don't want to be waiting here, honestly. Don't like waiting here. You want to attack the monster so that your diapelogist attack goes up. You don't want to... Uh, just to make sure we avoid any uh, unnecessary assistance touches. So, uh, I'll say you let them have it because this one's recent. Uh, this one is something you don't want to let go of so you want to just cancel this thing real quick. Nah, he ain't taking any of that shit. So let's see. Mm. So yeah, you always want to make sure you have something extra in your hand, so don't try to put anything down either. Because uh, I think he still has one more card that you want to kind of look after. And, uh, well, I'll suggest you kind of summon, I'll say you summon a uh, Buster Blader. So, I'll say you put, put uh, summon Blue Dragon Summoner and play Jump Kitchen. And, uh, Swamp. And the Swamp Tank. Yeah. 
I think for both of them and um, face down defense position. In a sense to me, uh, what you what do you want to go after? What do you, what do you want to go after is um, is it uh, Buster Blader so you can summon him so you can get extra points for summoning Buster Blader. Either way, Buster Blade, you don't gotta worry about Buster Blade actually getting in the way since um, Buster Blade, since Buster's uh, attack points are gonna be uh, way up, what? So, 46, there's nothing he can do about it. So, we're good, now we're just gonna stall until we finish this game. So this is what you want to look after. You don't want to let go of this one either. So you can throw away your um, your poly. You don't need that thing. You already used it. You only need to summon one monster and that's it. Uh, so you don't have to worry about not having that, uh, extra copies of dark patterns. And you really don't need to bring out more than just one. Uh, yeah, we want to keep... Uh, Facing the the monster's attack, to make sure that we can get a uh, clean uh, 10k at the end. Let's see. Okay, so this this will help us to speed up the process. You don't want to cancel out your own thing. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, I think we're just gonna keep ending this time until we finish. Now, I think this is pretty much it. You already know how this goes. We're gonna make sure we pull out a Grace Keeper. Uh, pull out the next unit attack. And then passage that into Victor into into Victor. So and then passage and then straight to face. So yeah, I tried that shit. It did not work out. Try two points and didn't work out, man. So, I'm not doing any more points about this right about now, but I mean it though. We're going straight to the treasure, if you know what I mean. Treasure <laughs> uh, was a little try, but I had to do it for, had to do it for the YouTube, you know? One time for the views. Now you let that shit go, cause now that you're under a thousand points, you're actually gonna get extra credit points at the end. Uh, now we're just gonna fucking, we're going straight for the treasure, man. Straight for the treasure, straight to the. We're gonna ride this dude of everything they can hold together right now. We're gonna use everybody together. We're coming together to make sure this shit happens right here, right now. About to see it happen right here live. That's it. This is it. This is how you do it. This is how you actually go ahead and get your hands into the treasure pot so that you can get hopefully the card that you're looking for. So that's essentially it. You only need to summon one monster and that's Dark Paladin. You want to make sure you summon them as soon as possible. That's the second turn in and now you're fucked. So let's see what we got here. Oof. What we got? Ooh, motherfucker. I already got like two cups of motherfucker. I don't need that shit no more. That's cool, I guess. That's cool. Yeah. Don't need none of that shit. So now, let's see. Now let's go over the cards again just to make sure that we know that we know exactly what we're working with. Like I said, 10 out of 10. I have a lot to do. Until next time. One time out. One time play. This is it. Get it. Get with it. Be square. Subscribe, like, comment.